There's a peculiar smell outside. What is it? You came because you sensed me thinking of you. Inadvertently, I touched you with my thoughts. And it isn't the first time. Indeed, it isn't. Scattered thoughts and anxieties pop into my head. Because we're connected, you and I. I'm sorry you have to hear them sometimes. That's my mother awakening inside me. I can't help it. Because I see you. It's alright. Useful, even. I had a dream yesterday. All our children lay on the ground, and a white flower grew from each of their heads. You'd water them when they were sad, and sometimes picked leaves from them for your potions. And then a cart ran over them all, and its wheels ground them to dust. Someone else is coming to the town. Death in an iron cart. Actually, you're right. Death is coming to our town in an iron cart. Precisely. So you see these dreams too. Death came to our town a week ago. I'm taking them from you. The ones you took care of. I'll do it now. And I'll do it better. The kids? Taking them? What do you mean? When... When the trouble comes for them, let me be the one to shield them, not you, alright? I'll speak to it myself. It doesn't ask who it should visit. You can't look after them as I do. They'll die if they remain your wards, because you're still so far from understanding. You can't sense the town as I do. I'm taking them from you. Hmm. So you want to become a mistress? I'm becoming one already. So looking after them is my duty. You're getting ahead of yourself. No. Even if I die, I'll still linger. In them. In you all. Even in you yourself. I've seen that too. Strange. So have I. Still, we're too different, you and I. I will always be your ally, but we aren't friends. I'm sorry. I've had enough of this nonsense. Everyone who entrusted their lives to me remains under my protection, including you. Man, I'm worried about Capella. Victoria Ogumskaya's daughter is our new mistress. Why do children have to take after their parents? That's a huge burden on them. And if they really have to look death in the face and talk to it, and they're, what are they, like 16 or something? Oh. Okay. I have 30 minutes to get over to the termitary. <laughs> yeah, that's obviously not happening. Oh shit, you know what? I couldn't... Uh, I can't give Capella immunity boosters because they weren't at home when I went here? Like, it's still going to... It, I guess basically at midnight it considers that Capella has gone home and slept here because they will still roll to see whether they get infected. But if Capella isn't home at the time that I go there, I can't give them immunity boosters and I can't give them immunity boosters here when they're not at home. So, good luck Capella, I'm sorry, I can't do anything. They're the only one that I didn't give immunity boosters to, I think. Yeah. I never actually gave treatment to Katarina or Anna. <laughs> if Anna lives, it's going to be a freaking miracle. I'm not sure where to go from here. I desperately need food. I need healing items. Sleeping would be good, but I need 
What was that weird noise? I don't know if that'll show up in the recording, but I heard like a blip. Like a squeak. Like a corrupted audio file squeak, not like a mouse squeak. Anyway. I want to sleep to get my health back, but I can't do that unless I get food. Otherwise, I'll just starve to death in my sleep. So... Yeah. Kind of just wondering about what's going to happen at midnight, you know? What what of these opportunities are going to be left for me? If any. Hmm. How's my immunity? Mediocre. How do I get health? Really, it's just by sleeping. So then the question is, how do I get food? Fuck if I know. <laughs> it's possible VAR will have some bandages. How's my scalpel doing, by the way? Ooh, it's fully repaired. You don't say. I've got a very dangerous idea. I've got a very dangerous idea. I can sell organs. Holy crap, that's the most loot I've ever seen on a person. Including food, that's not enough to get me through sleep though. Not at all. They even had a freaking knife. It's a better condition than mine. Also, I just noticed that there's a special animation when you do a charge up knife attack when you're sneaking. It's like a... well, I mean look at it. It's like that. Brutal. Anyway, um, they'll know, but you know what? I don't care, I'm gonna sell some organs. Damn, I'm getting lucky. Oh, what's that gonna do to my reputation? Oof, went down pretty fast. But no one's gonna punch me, right? No one says I'm unwelcomed, so it's fine. We almost at midnight. Three more minutes. Oh man, some bad stuff or some good stuff could happen. I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay, tomorrow everything changes, so it may be unwise to put off important business. So maybe I have more time? A generous reward awaits you in the fund. If you don't claim before tomorrow evening, it will be distributed among the poor. Oh, right. The fun becomes available right away, so I could... Th that should have tons of food. Okay. How are we doing? Non-infected. Not that I care that much about Big Vlad, but it's nice. Vlad the Younger I do care about. Nice. Laura, come on. Fuck. That was too close. Anna? Bye bye Katarina? Eh. Okay, I'm glad. They're not a high priority, but they're alright. <laughs> yes! Come on, come on, Peter, Peter. Fucking hell, this is so stressful. I'm just like clenching my whole body. Yulia, yeah, you're good. My cat's hacking up a hairball behind me. Sorry for the noise. Yep, Andre's good. Okay! That was good. One person died, a person that I didn't really care about. Um, nobody knew got infected, right? I don't think. Yeah, that was pretty good. <sighs> Whew. Time waits no more. So what's still available? Oh, the murderer thing's still available? The termitary? Thank God. All that's still available, okay. Okay, I want to do all of that. Do I have time to sleep and do all of that? Uh... Erm... Um, uh, I have two fingernails. Oh, hey! Now that death isn't on my back, I think they'll take me 
Anywhere I want to go for one fingernail instead of two. Yeah. It isn't uniform. Each day is followed by a shorter night. And each night by a yet shorter day. The end is closer than you think. Is that a bad guy? Oh, that is, I think. Gotta be careful. One hit and I'm dead. And I haven't saved in a while. So, I'm gonna go to Vars. Sell my organs, see if they have bandages and stuff. And then... Mm, and then I'll probably take a boat closer to the fund to get there as fast as possible to get a shit ton of food. Yeah. Yeah. Man, this fucker. You're right in the way. You're right in the way, my dude. What just happened? Oh, I've discovered that this place is infected. Hmm, that's interesting. It says Bad Grief is in danger because, I guess... Yeah, because Bad Grief, I guess, sort of lives in the cathedral now? So, I don't care about the kinds in particular, but, I mean, you know, I'll give them some basic tinctures. I don't want to use plus tinctures on them, but might as well give them basic tinctures. Should I do it right now? It, it would be an opportunity to save. Yeah, okay, let's do it right now. It'll take very little time. Have I ever gotten a generous reward from the fund? I wonder what they're gonna give me. A gun? Hello, here you go. I know you hate my guts, but you might want the prophylaxis. Wait, did I go? Oh shit, I went the wrong way. It's fine. It's not like I'm dying or anything. I'm good. Don't worry about it. Wait, what? Is there a back entrance? Ah. What's up, Georgie boy? Oh, I can actually talk with them. Huh. Um, what tincture am I going to be taking myself? Metro will increase my exhaustion. This will increase my hunger. I'll probably take the exhaustion one. So let's give them the hunger one. Katarina shouldn't have cast Changeling out. Clara is her true successor. Her own daughter couldn't have been closer. Wait, Katarina shouldn't have cast the Changeling out, so they de-adopted their daughter? Their adopted daughter? Huh. That was short-lived. So you've come. A father and Simon. What do they have in common? What is a town? A bunch of houses on a patch of land. What is a town? An organism. A town is a process. It's movement. More often than not, it's slow and aimless. Town creeping across the land like an oil stain. 
We wanted to make a town that would grow upwards, quickly, purposeful. And what would be its purpose? In this town, people can make the impossible. If they're capable, of course. For it is a machine. A border-breaking machine. What work does this machine do, I wonder? It pushes people. To do the impossible. To save themselves from drowning by pulling themselves up by their own hair. To force butterflies from their sad shells. To step over, break, overcome boundaries of thinking and sensing, first and foremost. The limits of their conception of the world. <laughs> and then Artemis just like, you're insane. See the polyhedron? The tower on the other side of the river? No, my friend, that's the issue. It is not yet on the other side, and that is quite symbolic. What do you mean? Just like a person, the town is a process. It grew from ancient times, imprinted upon the Neolithic abattoir, from the ancient steppe upwards toward the Gorkin. Now it finds itself pressed against the river, a border. The town has faced its limit, unable to move forward, unless we do the impossible. Well, maybe we're fine as we are now? The time has come for us to cross to the other side. Even the polyhedron, defying the law of gravity, one of the most binding architectural laws, is still not there. It stands on an island between the two banks. It is a bridge. We've raised our foot over the abyss, but have yet to step forward. Frozen in the middle, we are. Still, this is a lot. How does it remain there? Without magic, believe me, limits can be challenged without miracles. All you need is will and imagination. The rest is technicalities that you're unlikely to understand. Or are you an engineer? Have you studied structural loads? How would... I'm just curious, how would understanding structural loads in engineering help you understand how something stays up that, by all teachings of structural engineering, would say it's impossible? No, not interested in engineering. This tower proves that any limit can be challenged. We currently believe death is inevitable, just as we once believed human flight to be impossible. But people achieved it, and crossed unimaginable distances. This tower triumphs over the law of Earth. So, this is what Father and Simon used to talk about? They used to discuss the town, its change in direction. They argued. I don't know what your father believed in. Simon won't tell us anything, not anymore. But I've explained his ideas to you. Hmm. Thank you, Judge. That would be enough. I'm not sure what to say beyond food for thought. It's very interesting, but I don't know what to say. Um, where was I going? Uh, yes, to Vars. Let's go around the back so we don't meet any bad people. Whoa, is that a bad? Is that a baddie? Oh no, that's one of the half-bads. They beat up the sick, but other than that, they won't hurt me, I think. Oh shit, shit, my immunity is super low. Okay, let's take this. That's going to increase my exhaustion. Yes. of ours. Please have healy thingies. Ah! 
Wait, am I... Shit, death has its eyes on me, I guess, because I've been here too long? I'm around the back of this place, goddammit. I don't have- I don't think I have anything to make- oh shit. Shit. Oh no. My immunity. I think- does Twyrine do something? No. Town is calling me, that's great. I need to get indoors. I need to get indoors. Uh... Egg? I don't know if I want to just keep trading away all my morphemes. I mean, I kind of need food, don't I? Although I think I'm about to drop dead from the infection. Mm. There's nothing I can take to increase it. Just get inside and I think I'll be fine. Okay, I think I'm okay. Hopefully they'll sell immunity boosters. God, I'm just hanging on by a thread. Oh fuck, this person up here is gone still, damn it. Oh, yes. I will take all of that, thank you. 600 for a heart, 250 for a kidney, 900 for a brain. That's pretty good. Okay. Tourniquet. Bandage. Immunity booster. Alright. Now I've got a little bit of leeway. Little bit. <laughs> Big emphasis on little bit. Nothing else I want. Nope. Goodbye, Africa bloodstain. Okay. I want to get out of this infected place as quickly as possible. You know, it'll be pretty fast just to run forwards, actually. I was thinking of going kind of through the back and across the water to get to the boat, but... Nah, let's do this. I need to sleep. 1.30? Like, I got a bit of time. A bit. I could sleep for like an hour, maybe two? I'd prefer coffee, though. More people in danger? Oh, fuck. I thought I would escape the plague by being here, but... Oh, shit. That means... That means I can't even take this boat. I don't think they'll leave an infected spot. Shit. Hmm. Man, listen to those little squeakers. I need either coffee or I need to sleep very soon. I'm just trying to think, where can I sleep? Like, I guess I'll go to the theater since it's here, and then the fund, and then up to Lara's place? Then I could take the boat. Yeah, 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 yeah. And try to treat Lara, although I don't have many tinctures or anything. <laughs> okay. Yeah, also I don't have a lot of stuff for the dead item shop, but I have some stuff. Two of that, maybe the scrap is good. Rotten f Ooh. Rotten food. That's about it, but it's something. Squeakers. This is a dead end. Let's get out of here. Oh shit, my immunity is pretty much gone again. It's alright, we'll be out of here in a second. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Okay. We're good. 
Oh, some weird nasty noises. Hmm. It's nice to have enough leeway to start looting things again. Am I going the right way? Oh, right, I'm behind the theater. Yeah, that's fine. Let's go around this way. What? Shit. Shit, shit, shit. they block your hit? I'm just like fucked. Yes, Swing yes, miss. what? Swing and a miss. Mm, are you even trying now? I'm so sick of Mark Immortel's drivel. Hunger, it's more hunger. Okay, sure. Great. Thanks. When was my last save? Oh, I think I'm gonna have to go to Vars again. Here we go. Theater. He knows how to protect people. What does it mean to protect someone? You can't lead them single file to a place where there are no bombs, no one with murderous intent. Not subjecting them to needless danger, but pushing them to face danger when needed. That's what protection means. But just how needed is it? If you are right, the need is real. If not, it was imaginary, and that is on you, on your conscience. Here, at war, there are no rehearsals, no tryouts, no second chances. General, sir, what are you talking about? We're not at the front lines. You have a direct order to stop the plague, meaning your job is the opposite of protecting people. You're here to kill. This is a criminal order, and I won't follow it. Yeah, you have a lousy role in all this. But let's try once again, from a different line of yours. That's who's coming later today. Ooh, those are enemies right out there, right in front of me. Also, I just started taking damage from, uh, from exhaustion, but I... I'm not sure how fast exhaustion hurts me. I don't know if it's as fast as hunger. If it is, I mean, you know, I'm screwed. To the fund, and then sleep for a couple hours at Lara's. Unless I find a couple coffee people along the way. Yeah. Man, there's a lot of enemies here. Drink some water. I'm going to need the stamina. Oh, uh, did the dead item shop get... Marked? Oh, it's there, huh? Yeah, yeah, I'm not going there. I'm really excited about what this reward is going to be from the fund. A gun, a bunch of bandages, just a shitload of food, coffee? I'm taking damage pretty fast. It honestly seems about as fast as hunger. I need to deal with this very quickly. Am I being chased? Shit, I am. That's fine. Holy shit. 
I'm rich. That is so worth it to max out the fund. Holy crap. I wish there was coffee, but damn. Oh my god, that is so fucking good. Holy shit. Um, let's have the pemmican. That should finish out my hunger. Yeah. Wow. A whole fresh meat and two things of smoked meat? That is so much food. And then some antibiotics? That is fantastic. That is so good. Ooh. Got a fight going on. Okay, I need to sleep. They have a knife. I'm not fucking with that. Goodbye. Trying to get to Laura's place. Hello, somebody to trade with? Scrap name for two. Uh, for a grindstone? Yeah, totally worth it. I kind of desperately need grindstones. I also desperately need to sleep, like, right now. Can't repair anything. Oh, fuck. This is infected? Shit. At least I have a little bit of immunity left. This Laura's place? No, not quite. Almost there. Come on. That little violin bit. That's the second time I've heard it. medicine later. Hunger's good, thirst is good, it's just exhaustion, so... Let's take the painkiller. Oh shit, that just lowered my hunger. It seems the painkiller has the same effect as the Yoss Plus, right? Because this is white colored, so it's like it was made with a Yoss tincture. It seems to have the effect of the Plus, where it Lowers your hunger, or exhaustion, or thirst. Cool. That's gonna have to be it. I don't have time to do more. I've got stuff to do. Desperately thirsty. Um... Is there any... No, I, I can't treat Laura right now. I have no tinctures. Alright, I gotta get to the boat, and I need to get going. Oh wait, this is an infect district. Fuck. They're not gonna take me, right? Oh, hello. White whip. Yeah, you won't take me. All right, well, there's another one just a little bit over there, unless that's infected too. Thankfully, my immunity naturally goes up just with time for being healthy, so it's up a bit more. Yeah, this, this place is fine. Well, I'm here and it's a new day. Five, six, seven, two and a half hours. Uh, let me stop the pharmacy. Bandages, etc. My health, my health is still not amazing. I haven't had full health in forever. And it sounds like somebody just started chasing me. <laughs> Oh, 
bitch. Yes. And tourniquet. I'll take it all. Fucking hell, that's expensive. But I have 9,000. Hmm. I think I should buy antibiotics, too. I almost have max health. Holy shit. I can fight with my half-broken knife. Kind of. Okay. To the boot. Uh-oh. It's fine. It's fine. Oh no. Fucking. You gotta be kidding me. I thought that was a through path. <sighs> it's only fair that I take the death. What are you doing? Yeah, fuck off. Okay, well, I guess it's only fair that I don't take the death, apparently. Mother Bodo has looked down upon me today. Or looked... Uh, uh, I... Hmm. That sounded weird, but... Yes. I need to see what's inside that package. Uh, I'll just drop the rotten food. <laughs> I don't feel particularly attached to the rotten food. Well, now I'm back to basically dead. However, now that I survived that encounter, actually, I just realized I feel justified in loading my save game. I felt like I needed to take the death before I loaded. But since I survived, yeah. I feel justified in doing this. Just healed up at the pharmacy. Waiting for my stamina to come back because there were two enemies directly outside. Let's see if they're still there. No, they're right out there. Okay. Should I try to punch him in the back? No, 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 no. Don't get involved. Shit's gonna go south. It always does. Just run past him. Shit. It's okay, almost there. There's so many enemies here. We're fine though, we're fine. We're fine. Yes. Okay. Uh six, seven, I have two hours. Most important important to me this finding my father's murderer thing like I, I seriously doubt this is the murderer that the kids have found right the murderer of my father seems to be just a phantom everybody thinks they've caught him multiple times but nobody has so I'm gonna say that's low priority termitary is the highest bad grief is the next and then this is the lowest so Let's go here. Then again, if I go here, I... Mm, no, no. Let's go here. And then I'll do the bad grief thing. Maybe stop at home very briefly to drop off stuff or, like, try to repair my weapon. And then see if I can get inside of the dormitory. Yeah, let's go. Do the bad grief thing. It's nice and safe in the warehouse district. Uh, never mind, it's infected. Shit. Six. I have an hour and a half. 
want to go back and make tinctures, but I don't think I really have the time, so I'm going to stop by the shady shop and see if I can get uh, immunity boosters. Wouldn't it be funny if I go in here one day and the shady shop salesperson is just dead? You don't have any immunity boosters. Shit. I mean, I don't need food, so... Uh, peanuts are worth it. They'll stack and they're good for trading and they're pretty cheap, but... Yeah... Alright, just gonna tough it out. I mean, I can probably get in and out of here pretty fast. Another reason I want to do the bad grief thing is because because of where I am and, you know, who I'm doing this for, I feel like there's a small chance this could net me a gun or something. And I'm definitely going to want better weapons for the termitary if I have to fight my way in. Anything in here, by the way? From when I looted it a million years ago? No. Oh, oh shit! The clock is knocked over. I can't save here. <laughs> 